Okay, so this is Gamer Dom, and welcome back to my channel. This is a battle I had the other night um, in my FE 4202P, which is the British uh, Tier 8 Premium Medium tank that just came out fairly recently. Um, I'm with Bonkers and Flo, um, who are from my clan, um, and they're in the SDA 2s, which is the Japanese Tier 8 Premium Medium tank. And we're on steps, it's a Tier 8 game, so it was a good matchup. Um, we are heading over to the left to see what kind of mayhem we can cause. The, the good thing about these the sort of open 890 or 7890 uh, flank um, is just the ability to use the gun depression that both of these tanks have because there's a lots of little sort of hollows and what have you that we can get in. Um, and um, it's nice and open so you don't tend to get caught out too much. So that has its positives and negatives because if the enemy are, are good campers then um, they can cause some real hell to you. So we're pushing up, doesn't look like they're committing themselves too heavily. There's a lot of tanks sitting back on their, on that ridge in front of their base. Um, I got a little bit, I, I played a fairly, um, I guess that evening I'd had a lot of uh, aggressive games where I was getting killed quite quickly so I was uh, taking it a little bit more gently this time which meant I was quite a long way behind the other two. Um, this tank's quite slow anyway but you know it's worked out to my advantage because I can get some shots on these guys. Um, trying to get some snipes and this gun on, that was a good shot, that did actually go through him. The, uh, this gun is really good for uh, long range sniping shots. <laughs> he says and then proceeds to miss. Uh, so Bunkers has got a kill already. We're pushing this um, flank quite heavily um, but there are quite a lot of tanks there but we're 5-2 up already so that's all good. That shot for the Cromwell, there you go. See I just talk about how accurate this, this gun is and then I proceed to donk one into the dirt as well. So hey ho. Uh, I'm trying to hit that A44 because from XVM I know that he was their best player by some long distance so I thought if I can take him out cheaply then that will help but uh, bonk has got another kill so he's up to two um, I've only done about 500 damage so far but it is 6-2 so it's been a very successful push and you can see the danger the enemy team had there they camped so heavily on that crest and then for some reason a couple of their tanks came out the front um, and we just ripped them apart there were so many mediums um, and uh, accurate guns firing at them they had no chance at all we're pushing on. I've taken the direct route because I'm pretty certain that there's nothing now lining that wall along there. And I want to get into the goodies before they all disappear. Um, one shot into the uh, T-34-1. But really, I don't know whether I'm going to get another shot because... <laughs> yeah, Bonker's got a taste for it. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, he's rolling. Oh dear, and I missed him because he rolled. <laughs> he rolled when I was firing at him. <laughs> so Flo gets the kill that time. So I'm letting the team down. I haven't got a kill yet. Um, Flo's got one. Bonkers has got three. And there's a... don't know what he's thinking of, Carnarvon. Tracked him with the first shot. I'm going to take a shot. I don't mind. Put a shot into his... Uh, he wasn't actually firing at me, so which is good. Flo gets his second kill. There's a T32, put a shot into him, that was a good roll, 232, 237 is a good roll. Push on, they're down to four tanks, done a thousand damage. Yeah, I think our platoon's showing its worth in this, this matchup. We are a premium platoon, but even so. Um, I leave I leave the um, T32 and the um, SU100 to the team, and I think I push along and try and get around the back of the um, IS and the um, A44 and um, sure enough they deal with uh, with those guys quite easily I think we haven't got an awful lot around our cap, cap so that was one of the reasons I went this way because I just thought hey the the IS3 is on near full health so I can um, farm more hit points in fact he is hill, full health uh, first shot trying to track him I don't want to get a lock on him actually, I don't know why, sometimes the auto lock doesn't work. So I'm chasing him, I'm right behind him, Bonkers has been killed which is a shame. And IS3, there's someone behind your chuff and he's driven straight into a rock. 
Oh, and then I then I failed to penetrate from one yard. What? <laughs> I don't know what he's thinking here. I actually loaded premium, which is a bit of a waste. But what the hell? And I don't think he can now get his gun down on me. No, he can't. So I've tracked him in place there, and got a damaging shot. And we just between me and uh, Flo, we're working this guy over. Oh, we didn't get the kill though. Somebody stole our kill. And here comes the A44. Managed to turn around and bounce a shot from him. Which is nice. Oh, can I get the last kill? I haven't got a kill yet. I haven't got a kill yet. Please give me a kill. Hello Mr. <laughs> A44. I'll ram him as well. Put the last shot through his front plate. Can I? Come on, give me the kill. Yes, there we go. So finally finally do something gg good carry that was a good game in the end we finished up with the second class mastery bruiser far for effect um people play this tank so so well so it's really hard to get anything up i've sold it well i've seen uh, i've featured uh, a game from f um, turbo from my clan who got a first class i think i've got a first class that's as high as i've managed to get you must have to do a hell of a lot of damage to get a for um an ace tanker in this tank so i was quite happy with that um and you can see and that's not bad as a platoon <laughs> did we do well we finished first second and third on xp bonkers was out there in on top with 3000 damage three kills 1026 base xp i got second spot with 2000 damage one kill 901 base xp flow got uh, two kills and 1800 damage and um, 813 damage so really good carry all round for our team for our platoon just shows again you know coordinating as a platoon uh, and driving similar sort of tanks because although um, the STA2 is quicker they're pretty good both pretty good tanks in terms of having gun depression a bit of turret armor pretty accurate guns so it worked well I fired 18 shots 13 of which connected and 10 penetrated for my 2000 damage so that was pretty good um, I took two shots one penetrated one didn't that was right at the end of the game i think pretty much um got a thousand uh, spotting damage i do carry um coated optics on this tank so um, um that helps that score um nearly eighty thousand credits which was nice oh i got compensation being damaged by enemies i didn't even see that so anyway whatever um, gave us a nice healthy profit of 47,000 which is really really good uh, it was a time three weekend battle so uh, with all the bonuses um, <laughs> whistles and bells we got five and a half thousand XP which was absolutely outstanding so really really good game good carry good teamwork and I think that's again what I was trying to stress with this video is you know this was a, this was a platoon of three um and we worked together as a three we stayed together where possible i got lagged a little bit behind but even then i was supporting the guys we were talking to each other on team speak and making sure that we um we were sort of focusing down various tanks and, and it worked it worked really nicely again so um yeah get yourselves out there get in platoons join a clan come and see um come and see what our clan has to, to offer the um the havoc community is a is a really really good one um, mainly because there's multiple clans under the umbrella so you can uh, uh, you share the same team speak and can get to play and talk with uh, people from a whole load of different clans including some from the north american um server so um they obviously can't play for a north american server unless you have a north american account but uh, you can talk to the guys there which is kind of nice so anyway this, is game, this has been gamer dom thanks for watching hope you enjoyed the video if you did please consider giving this a like and maybe subscribe for more content and i'll see you again enjoy your games have fun try not to take them too seriously gamer dom out <laughs>